N4 is a 90 with a 10 degree offset. Step one is make marks for offset bend. Measure from point J to point K. It is six inches. Measure the height of the offset. It is one and a half inches. Measure from point J to point L. It is 27 inches. We're using 10 degree bends because if you use 30 degree bends, the distance between the marks would be too close together and you wouldn't be able to get the bends in that tight. One bend would run into the other. Using the leftover piece of conduit, make a mark at six inches. We know that we have a one and a half inch offset. We will take one and a half inches times six, since six is the multiplier for 10 degree offset bends. One and a half inches times six equals nine inches. Make another mark nine inches from the first mark. Trace the mark all the way around the conduit. Step two is bend the offset. Put the arrow of the conduit bender on the first mark. Bend to 10 degrees. Look at the bender head to ensure that it is 10 degrees. Flip the conduit over and go to the next mark. Put the arrow of the bender on the mark. Look down the conduit and line up to ensure that you will not create a dog leg. Apply pressure close to the conduit bender to ensure that the conduit is bent at the conduit bender and not further down the conduit. Bend to 10 degrees. Check for dog leg. If you do have a dog leg, remove it. Use level to see if offset bends are equal. Adjust if it is overbent or underbent. Look down the conduit to determine if you need to add or subtract from your first or second bend. Measure to see if the offset is at the correct height. Step three is mark and make 90 degree bend. Point J to point L is 27 inches. Lay the conduit against the surface and measure 27 inches back from the end of the conduit. Make mark all the way around the conduit. Determine which direction the 90 needs to be bent. Use the star on the conduit bender for the bend over to point N. Line up star on mark. Put offset on the ground and bend conduit using equal hand and foot pressure. Use a level to ensure the bend is 90 degrees. Make adjustments using conduit bender handle if necessary. Place conduit on conduit board. Mark at point M. You could also measure from point L to point M and mark conduit at correct length. Cut conduit on mark. Ream conduit. Place conduit onto conduit board and put conduit couplings on. 